Jeremiah's Hope Academy, we really look for those individuals who've had struggles in their life and continue to have struggles in their life. We have a lot of single moms that um, we particularly try to enroll in this program. And so for us, it's not just a come to school in the morning, leave, study, take your tests and be gone. We provide a lot of additional services for these students here. We have an employment specialist here, and so she works with our students even two years post-graduation to make sure that these students that have so much potential, if someone will just invest in them and take interest in them, that they have everything that they need to be successful. One of the great things, among many great things about Jeremiah's Hope, is that the focus on the medical community is particularly important to Birmingham. There are a lot of great professionals that come, but we also need those entry-level medical positions as well, because if we don't have a good infrastructure and we don't have a good workforce and we're not preparing that workforce, then ultimately that's, it's not sustainable. Currently, uh, out of my full-time staff, 50% uh, have come through Jeremiah's Hope and have done very well. Over at uh, St. Vincent's, we, uh, we're getting quality associates who are nationally accredited. All the certifications are actually national certifications, and that's very intentional. So we're not only furnishing these employees, these great associates throughout Birmingham and Alabama, but they can work anywhere. Coming in and actually meeting the instructors and being in the classroom and being in the environment, um, I immediately sense a presence of acceptance. When I get up in the morning, I love coming to work. I love coming to work. Being able to give back, being able to um, impart the knowledge that I have into others. It brings me joy when I'm able to see them over at the hospital working. And they have become what? Now not my students, but they have become my coworkers as well. And that brings so much joy to my heart. I do phlebotomy, EKG, um, we have extra courses that's really helpful like PD, professional development. I wanted to serve more and I know through this program I know this was the open door for me. So this is definitely a career that I want. They were willing to tap not only into my academics and making sure that I learned the information but to make sure that I'm okay while I'm going through the program. Not only to show care for it just my schooling, like, oh, yeah, I'll take my class, I'm gonna make sure you pass my class, but I'm gonna make sure you're a good person, I'm gonna make sure you have the foundation, I'm gonna make sure that if you do fall, that I'm here, like, they show me a lot of support and a lot of encouragement. As much as we wanted to expand Jeremiah's Hope Academy, there's really no other physical space. So several years ago, we began looking at the St. Vincent's East campus. And so we were able to extend Jeremiah's Hope Academy to a lot of the rural communities here in this part of the state. We could not possibly have created that second site and those opportunities for those individuals in that part of the state and in our rural communities without the support from regions. If we can prepare individuals to enter that medical field, even at entry level positions, well it's helping to build a stronger community, which really helps build a stronger regions. And so that's why we're so devoted to it. To be able to give back, I know I keep on saying that, but that's the most rewarding part, to be able to just give back and see others blossom and bloom um, into great healthcare workers.